Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Wee Burns Cradle. How are you guys? Can you believe it's the end of the year? 2021, just around the corner. Tomorrow, in fact. I'm here today to share with you two of my partial silicone babies. One of them is an Ashton Drake silicone baby, and my other one is one of the few that I own. And she is the Charlotte Sculpt by Angela Lewis. And I named her Megan Home. And my Ashton Drake silicone is the Natasha or Tasha silicone. And I named her Riley Winter. So stay tuned, guys. so sweet I'll put you down a little bit so these are my two partial silicones this one here is the Ashen Drake and this one is uh, the Charlotte Sculpt by Angela or, is it the Charlotte Sculpt oh my goodness <laughs> guys I might have completely forgotten I can't think right now. I think my Charlotte Sculpt is the one in my basket over there. Um, it's not the Little Warrior. Um, <laughs> I completely forget. I just named her Megan Hope. She was my very first partial, well, not my first, my first Ecoflex 20. I do have an Ecoflex 30 partial silicone that I opened the mouth of. She's in the bedroom right now. But the reason why I chose Megan is because these two are roughly the same size. Well, it looks like her head is bigger. Oh, I just thought, I did put a reborn body on her though. So she, I will put a link to that video um, of me changing. This is a reborn body. It's not the body that she came with by Ashton Drake. I Maybe I'll get my other, my Ecoflex 30. The thing is, um, a lot of the Ecoflex 30 silicone babies aren't as popular anymore. They're either Ecoflex 20 or this new Marshmallow. Um, I think it's the Ecoflex 10. Uh, she is a 20. Oh, I love her. She is, she is. Oh, I love her. And I reweighted her perfectly. And um, this one, I did reweight. But she's still not as, wait. Her silicone's not as heavy as real, real, real silicone. So I'm not sure. Well, she just has a reborn body on. Same with her. So. Uh, but I do notice, though, like, with me owning these dolls, this one obviously is factory made. This one is artist reborn um, created. And I notice that over time, the real, the real paints like start to wear down i still love her i still love her painting she's wonderful um i am lucky she hasn't really lost a lot of any paint maybe a little in the thumb but this one the ash and drake hasn't lost any at all in her head there's something i think she might have like a styrofoam on the inside of her. She's not completely fully silicone. Her mouth does not open either. And I was thinking, somebody asked me if I could open her mouth, but I feel like there's styrofoam behind the silicone.
she she could be a little more sticky i did bring my powder this is um this is just like baby powder with cornstarch mm, i love the smell oh so pretty and i i do powder her up um somebody else was asking me about bash and drake's hair like this is factory made and probably factory rooted like a machine just rooting and the hair is a lot like wig so i mean it's kind of hard to like wreck it <laughs> this stuff is a lot more delicate she has mohair rooted mono rooted is falling out the back like a bald spot like a real baby well i noticed her ears are starting to lose some paint on the inside oh but i still love her and she does have an open mouth oh i love her this one i don't know i'm still not completely satisfied like her head is kind of light and i did take her apart like i have a video of that and she is I, with this new reborn body she is like more squishy and cute i don't know why she makes me want to talk like that but she is definitely more like I feel like I don't have to be as delicate handling her than this one. This one definitely have to be delicate. This one, I don't know. See, I wish her head was more. She's still a cutie. She's still a cutie. I I have my other partial silicone. Um, but before I bring her out, I want to mention that she is not the Charlotte. She is the Brooklyn by Angela Lewis. So, um, but I brought Anna Amelia because she is, I think she's more in proportion to the Ash and Drake. So, now, Anna, the uh, I named her Anna Amelia, by the way. Her name is Anna Amelia Eve. And she is Ocean Sculpt by Michelle Fagan. And I had a, a hard time bonding with this one, so to speak. Yeah, she is more... Her body is stuffed. Now, when I received her, I didn't know how to reweight babies. So I would definitely love to have her reweighted. Now she is in Ecoflex 30. They used to call it the dragon skin back in the day. Um, but the thing is, and her body is old fashioned, but I love it because it's signed. So and by the way, she has beautiful, beautiful hair. And considering how old she is, I think it's still imperfect. Like, it's still soft. Like, Megan's hair is, um, my other partial silicone, her hair is getting, like, like, kind of stiff feeling. This one's just so soft. And there's barely a bald spot. Like, just the very bag. Now I did open her mouth and the silicone that I sealed around looks like drool, <laughs> but I like it. Let's see if I can get this outfit off. Oh, I was trying to protect because she is, she is really old, but considering her age, oh, she is still holding up super strong and i bought her second hand 
But see, she's stuffed. She's stuffed and it's on the old plane, but I love that she's signed. The Ocean number eight, Michelle Reagan, 2011, guys. 2011. Now, I bought her second hand back in like 2016, I think. And I never. Um, I did trade her once with Aaron. And Aaron did root new lashes on her. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to be delicate around her hair. <laughs> oh, she's so sweet. But then Aaron was selling her. And when she had her up for sale, I'm like, I need her back. It's like I opened her mouth, I feel connected to her. Like, imagine if I try reborn, I can't sell. <laughs> so, and this is like a, oh, it's a zero to nine. It's actually quite big. But I had her as a girl. I had her as a boy. Um, I first named her um, Amelia Eve. And, and then I thought, oh yeah, and then when she came back to me from Aaron, um, I named, I changed her into a boy and named him, um, Beckett Silver. Some hair. Now the thing about her, oh, she, like Eagle Flex 30 is very, very tough. It's even tougher than this. It's getting sticky. This one, not really. Like, she's still in, like, mint condition. Well, like, she has, her paint is still on. Her fingers look so sweet. But I'm not happy with this big, like, what they call it? Pinball? A you know, bowling ball pin? <laughs> Like these, like these diapers are huge and she's on an old body, but I'm just scared of, like, if I change her out, that's, I like this. When I change her out, she, she won't have a signed body anymore. Now, I don't think I reweighted her, but I think Erin might have. I'm not sure if she didn't tell me. Or maybe I did because I see. But like you see she's got. I don't know what this even says. I got, yeah. Now I remember. I did add more weight to her. But I mean she's still. An old fashioned body. Maybe I'll take out some stuffing right here. Maybe add some poly. Yeah, see, she was thinner, but I mean, she's still in like really, really good. Oh, she's so sweet. I love her hair. Oh, falling in love with her all over again. Oh, she is so sweet. And I opened her. She's, oh, she's so cute. She's so cute. I love this hobby. It's so calming. And her paint is still, like, very well. But, yeah, she just seems like a big flump. <laughs> I can't describe it other than flump. <laughs> and this one, I don't know, her legs look kind of small for this. And I'm sorry if the lighting is going in and out. I tried to fix it in my settings, but I'm not sure. Um, so, yeah, and she is like three quarter, I think. Oh no, it's full body. I feel like I may, I bought a big body. So, well, from here up, she looks proportioned, but from here down, she doesn't. So, this is just the diaper. It's a diaper hanging low. 
Well, this is when I tried to sage my... <laughs> oh, maybe it's just... Mm, this is back when I used to... So I want to try and fix these. Yeah. I should have got like a, a side loader. Not a front loader. Yeah, this is the wrong body, but it was only one that I had on me at the time. I think I would order her a new body, and I'd choose the signed. Yeah, because her legs are bent. Like if I had them a bit like this, and a smaller, shorter. And this one, Maybe if I actually do try and attempt to rewaint her, but the body shape is old fashioned. But I love this. So maybe like, maybe just buy her a new body, but keep like cut this out and turn it into a patch. I could do that. This one is. See, okay, see how her legs could be front-loading. See how natural they look when they're in the front? Not so much the side. Well, even, she could be either or. But this one, see how it's kind of odd being in the front? Should be at the side. I don't know. They're both still sweet, but I feel like I'm rambling. I love um, Aunt Amelia's hair. Oh, she's so sweet. I don't know, and then, and then I look through the camera, and her legs do look fine. Maybe it's I'll show you from my angle. So this is. From my angle, see how, see in the front, but if they were side loaders, they probably look, they're so some short. I don't know, the hurt line, or would these be three quarter? Maybe those are three quarter legs, that's why they look short. What do you guys think? Maybe this is a totally wrong body. Although, hers look. No. Yeah, but look at the foot. See how this one curves so much? And this one is kind of straight. Yeah, she got her side loader. But I mean, as for like, realistically, this does look like a full. I wonder, would this be a three? I should look up the scope. What if I had her on like a three? See, and I don't have any extra bodies. I would love to get her like a proper body. Like, see how it looks like a, like, thin, like a, like a, like a, <laughs> yeah. But they're still so sweet. Both of their faces are so cute. I love them both. So yes, Ash and Drake. I wonder if I should try and poke a hole in here. And then, and then she could have a pasta. See, I did, I opened her mouth. And then, um, I filled it in with silicone. And then I thought, ooh, her edges need to be done too. Oh, she's so sweet. I would love to have, like, more pictures. I love her hair, even though it's so messy, it looks so realistic. It's so soft. I wonder if it's human hair then. 
But anyways, guys, I'm just rambling. Uh, those are my two types of reborns. Well, silicones. One is an Ashton Drake, and one is a, a an actual reborn. I'll add Megan here. I love her. now. I reweighted her to to absolute how I love her. But yeah, see, her hair is like kind of. It's not super stiff like this one. You can tell it's like a wig. This one's super soft, and this one is like just like no hair. But they're all so sweet. Oh, they're so sweet. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me. I hope that you're having a great day and happy new year. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. And if you made it all the way through, thank you so much. And if you have any like advice on like these legs, like these, oh, I'm trying to move it like these. Is there a body type that you would suggest? Any information would be helpful. And I would probably love to buy her a new body too. But I love her signed body. That's why I kept it all these years. But I don't know. What would you guys do? <laughs> so anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me. And until next time, very soon, hopefully, I have to go back to work next week. So, and I teach in class. So, yeah. <laughs> Love you guys. Match a hand. Love you guys. This is my left hand, so I can't really move it up. <laughs> Here's my right hand. See how I'm different? Match a hand, guys. Love you. And until next time. Love you guys. Take care. Happy New Year. Happy Holidays. Be safe and healthy.